All right, so if you guys follow me on Instagram, which you should, because I post pictures of, well, considering what I post pictures of, that's probably not a very good selling point, but I did post these shoes yesterday when I got them in. These are the position weightlifting shoes. So they're geared more towards actual late weightlifting, which I will not do. I don't think ever, just not my style, but I originally saw these on Omar Esau's chan channel and then Michael Corey also picked up a pair. Yes, they are blue suede, but what really sold me on them for wanting to try them out is the heel. So these have a one inch effective heel height. Uh, they also have a wood composite type heel. So for anyone that's been in the shoe game a long time when it comes to weightlifting shoes, some of the most popular ones out there have been the Adidas Addy Stars, and those were like the last real mainstream brand I would say that had a wooden heel. Um, nowadays, everyone else goes more rubber, and as you probably know, wood doesn't compress as much. Now, of course, they've made great strides in rubber technology, I'm sure, where some of the things in like the Addy Powers or the Romelios, uh, they are much more firm. But I wanted to give these a try for a couple of reasons. Like I said, it was a bit higher of a heel, and every little bit counts. At least that's what I've been told. Um, this is an American company, too, so I want to be giving these a little bit of a use. And I don't know exactly how well they'll work out for me and my weird squatting stance. I think probably, again, they'll be more geared towards weightlifting. But I thought it'd be interesting to try. I know some other people had some questions about these, so I'm going to be giving these a go. I think the hardest thing I'm going to have to adapt to with these is trying to figure out which clothes will match these best. Because I don't have anything that's like this baby blue suede. That gives me some wardrobe options. So that's that. Expect the full review later on. So I just finished my training session and I figured I'd give you guys my first general impressions of these position shoes. It's gonna take me some time to really give my final thoughts on them, but I think the initial impressions are sometimes the most accurate and the most beneficial. And I wore them today on my squat and bench press focus session. And one of the reasons I did it on this day, which is Sunday, is because for my squat work, I did three sets of seven at 180 kilos or 397 pounds. And that's actually one of my lighter days and rep work is just a kind of chance for me to, to bust out reps. And the reason I did that is I didn't want to go with something that I thought in my mind was going to be a big drastic difference with these higher heels and do it on one of my more intense days where the weight's heavier and I could potentially fuck my shit up if I wasn't careful. So I wanted to play a little bit safe, but in that instance, wearing these for squats today, I honestly didn't feel that much of a difference in the shoes. I thought I would be pitched far forward. I thought my knees might hurt a little bit more than they typically do, which isn't that much these days. Uh, and to be honest, I didn't really notice any difference whatsoever, which could be a good thing or could be a bad thing. Now, I posted this on Instagram, my initial thoughts. I did kind of play around with them off camera, just in a more narrow stance and see how that changed. And if I was more of a high bar squatter or did more Olympic lifting and had a narrower stance, I could definitely see them being even more beneficial. That seemed even easier than normal. Typically, it takes me a while to kind of warm up my ankles when I have a narrow stance to make sure my knees track forward. With these shoes, there wasn't really a problem, but I'm not a high bar squatter and I really don't want to start doing high bar right now just being four weeks out from competition uh, but I think they probably have a better transfer to someone who's interested in doing that I will say though as part of this rep work that I was doing I did kind of take my mind off things as sometimes happens when I'm doing rep work so higher reps in this case again uh, sets of seven in one of the instances my typical cue is to load the weight on my heels I just find that works well for me and I was just in the middle of doing this rep work and I kind of took my mind off that fact and I did get pitched a little bit forward on one of the reps and I thought for a second I might have to dump the bar my knees came in to correct it uh, and that was a little bit weird that was the only real instance I had with them uh, but I did correct that for the rest of the work on the day. So no real big difference on squats. So I was a little bit surprised by that. And again, I'll give you my feedback when I get some more time in the shoes. One of the things that I really did notice that I didn't like, however, is on bench press, the grip didn't seem to be as good as normally with my uh, Romaleos or Romelios or Addy Powers. Uh, typically those have a little bit better grip I found. So it was really hard for me to get my feet planted on bench and they were sliding around a lot, which is a big detractor for me because you guys know I don't arch that much and I can't arch that much. So really making sure I have a good solid footing is important because that's the only kind of real leg drive that I can manage. And in this case, it just wasn't available today. So that's a little bit disheartening, but it could just be that the floor here is dirty and I need to clean it. That could totally be it. Uh, but that's my initial first impression of the shoes. And you guys will hear more from me probably in a couple of weeks after the competition when I get some more time in it and can test it out under some heavier load. So hope that was insightful. Let me know what kind of questions or what other things you'd like me to cover in that review. In the meantime, as always, thanks for watching and stay big.